what's up guys this is Ashish Tiwai here and you are watching techno tips jquery tutorial so this is part 14 of this video series in this video I'll be discussing about the jquery effects especially the sliding effects so in previous tutorial I have just covered the visibility effects and now it's time to discuss about the sliding effects so here we will discuss about slide up slide down and slide toggle method okay so let's get it started so here in the previous tutorial we have just discussed about the show hide and toggle method okay so let's have a view of it so when I click on the first button it will show me the div 1 and the second button will hide div 2 and the third method will show hide the div 3 means toggle the div 3 so div 3 is hidden now div 3 is visible now okay now let's fulfill our today's objective so first of all just delete the content of this block and I will just keep this three button to explain the slide up method let's say it slide up div 1 and then slide down div again I'm just a I'll just take only one div here Diff one and then toggle slide toggle diff one okay so I have taken three separate button and I'm just copying the content okay so this is the dummy content where I have just an ID that is diff one and the background color is burgundy and the color is white and I have the title and paragraph okay so you can see here I have title and some description title and description okay and we have three button slide up slide down and slide toggle okay let's mo remove diff diff one because there is only one diff slide up slide down and slide toggle okay now let's use these all three methods here so on click of button one I'll just the uh, slide down the uh, div one that is use slide down so first of all I'll just uh, discuss the on button click uh, I'm just uh, slide slide up so I'll just use the slide up method here so slide up okay and the second button click it should be slide down here you can see all three methods slide up slide down so use slide down and on the button 3 when I click on the button 3 so diff 1 all all div 1 should be toggled okay so dot slide toggle the third method okay now let's reload this page so the first button uh, is used to slide up the div 1 so let's click on that okay second button should be slide down click and the third button should be used for slide toggle slide down and when I click again slide up slide up slide down slide up slide down okay now we will see the different parameter that we are passing inside this slide up method so just check it out so when I use this speed easing and callback okay so here I you can pass the speed like slow okay let's retry when I use this slide up and the parameter is slow so it see uh, slide up now save it and click on this so this is slope parameter okay 
instead of slow you can pass the uh, milliseconds so let's see so when I click on this slide up okay so it's not accepting the speed I think slide up should be say now now all the slide will be up if you pass the three second three millisecond let's say load this again and here here you can see it will take three seconds to get the diff hidden and you can also pass the second parameter let's say callback easy and callback so I'll just use the callback function first function f you can do the alert okay let's say let's say just call it slide up is complete okay so let's try this when you click on this slide up here you can see speed and now you will get the pop-up message slide up is complete okay so you can do any action means you can call Ajax you can perform any any different action let's comment this and here on the button to click slide up again I'm just passing the different parameter like two second here and uh, and the button three toggle so slow fast let's say click on slide up taking three slide down taking two second slide toggle should be fast here you can see okay uh, you can pass integer let's say 10 second see slide toggle S moving slightly up okay and when you click on this again so it will take 10 seconds to sliding down okay so this is very useful effect and uh, always give some slow is okay give slow as a parameter here and also you can call any function here So it's let's call um, call any function or you can see do anything okay so this is uh, this is an example of uh, slide up slide down and slide toggle okay so in this way you can just utilize this method slide up slide down slide toggle for implementing several effects in your project okay so here we have completed all three method so hope you like it and un understood this concept in the next tutorial I'll just cover the fading effects okay so thank you very much for watching if you like it then give us a thumbs up and don't forget to share this video among your friend and help them too okay have a great day